So around 15 years to build this car. Yeah, it's been, yeah, by the time it's completed, about 15 years. Wow. Wow, look at that. It's like it's been there since 1986, yeah. 85. That is really good. I like the fact that you went straight for factory. A lot yeah. of people, they just put upgraded turbos yeah. so they cannot get a hold on the yeah. piping from the intercooler, which is one of the rarest parts, yeah. I know for a fact. Paid two thousand just for that. Just for that. Just for that. Yeah, and it's got the steering pump on the back of the engine. Look, you see. Oh yeah. And this side. I've got the old that is my. Well. <clears throat> I've got the double wastegate to go on it. I'm just waiting for a, a, a little pump lift manifold. That is mad. If you look through that big hole in the inner wing, you can see all the brakes and the suspension and everything. Yeah. Original calipers. <laughs> wow. We've got original subframes on there as well. It's amazing. And, uh, spotted and seen, and uh, they're off one of the original cars. That is a lot of work. I have the, the headlights are they only weigh 40 grams, and people put the wrong headlights in. And I've, I've luckily enough to build this car side by side to an original S1 Audi UK's car, and uh, I've managed to. I put the I, I sold a, an original gearbox to Audi UK two weeks before Stick Longfest drove it at Goodwood because oh. they blew their gearbox up so they contacted me to supply them a gearbox so I supplied them a gearbox and went down there and helped them um, they obviously had the, they had the engine um, head gasket done from Leyland and uh, when that came back I gave them a hand to put the engine in and whilst before the engine was in I could identify all the work that had gone into the firewall and turrets and everything like that and take pictures and measurements and everything off of it just to see if everything was yeah, yeah. correctly assembled Wow, it's incredible. You don't see, like I said before, you don't see many people putting the time and effort and money no. into searching and trying to recreate something that was made several decades ago. So the original chassis that you had is from the Audi 80, yeah. and then you just shorted it. I've got original parts of the 20 cars welded to this car. I've got, ah. some sh I've got a chassis rail off one of the cars welded to the car. And uh, the front, the front caps. So the, the bumper, this original bumper, clicks on and off within seconds with these quarter turn screws and stuff. I can take it all apart. It's just as quick as an original car. Oh, nice! The exhaust is all sleeve joints as well. I can take that whole exhaust system off in ten seconds, literally. If it's on, if it's mm. on a ramp jacked up ready, I can take it off in about ten seconds. Yeah. At the time, all they had is very limited time to work on them anyway, so it makes everything easier. really really good sorry if you were to evaluate this car nowadays how much do you think it will go this for is, this is a million pound a million pound yeah because uh, the reason why it may be worth more but it's a minimum of a million pound I won't take a penny less I'd rather just take it to my grave yeah you know, I'd rather be buried in it and uh, the thing is, if someone said to me, J Jamie, I want a car exactly the same as that, then if they said to me, there's there's a million pound, go and find the parts. I know for full well fact that there's no parts left. Yeah, you won't find them anywhere. And I've, I've managed to um, meet many ex-works mechanics and uh, bought plenty of parts off them from Germany, Sweden, um, you know, France. Uh, Belgium, Audi Sport Belgium, Audi Sport France, and uh, they don't have the parts left, and no. the parts that they do have, they don't want to sell. So, usually they want to keep them for yeah, the old factory cars. To find all the parts like this now, the only way to do it is buy an original car.
and so it's going to be two million. Quid. Two million, easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's it's pretty much impossible to recreate. Yeah. That's what I'm amazed for your work and the amount of time that you put on because. I know how much my friend in Portugal is struggling to build his. Yeah. It's, it's not even close to the spec yeah. and parts that you got on yours. On, on, what's, his, and ta, what's his name? Andreas. Andreas, yeah. Andreas, the Godfather. His nickname's the Godfather. Yeah. Yeah, I've known him 12 years ago before everyone else was building these cars. Yeah, nice guy. It is a nice guy. Oh, look at that. It's really nice. The fuel cell is still original as well from factory? It's probably from the original fuel cell. I didn't want to use a 40 year old. Yeah, yeah obviously. <laughs> These are original. Like this is out of one of the cars. The alternator look. Yeah, see it there. Wow. This is this Walter, this is Walter Rolls radiator, and it was dated about six days before he took it out on the oh, RAC yeah. rally. Nice. And crashed it. 1985. It crashed it because it had the PDK gearbox in it, and, uh, and then after the Great B, Herbert Brutinator um, bought the car from Ingolstadt, and um, if you see the you see the damage on that corner. Oh yeah, I see it, yeah. And Herbert Brittonator like uh, painted it the Pioneer colours. When he was doing the rally course, he had a big massive uh, roll and it landed on this side and it damaged that radiator. Mm. And you, that's the, the scars still... Still there. Accident. And then it's slightly damaged there. Yeah, well. I can see the little dent so over there, yeah. Reason. That just proves, I like all that because it just got a little story to go with it. Yeah, you know? it's better than just replace it with a new yeah. pipe. Yeah. That makes it even better. It's all amazing the, the like amount of detail. It's incredible, man. I have to give it to you because this is not something that anybody can get. Even if you're a millionaire, you, you cannot get something like this. It's really, really nice. Would you mind if I film inside of it? Yeah. Wow. Just leave it open, yeah. Yeah. This year, as they came back on the third year, it was difficult to Amazing.